Today's Bible reading is taken from Nehemiah 8 verses 9 to 10. Sorry, 9 to 11. And Nehemiah, who was the governor, Ezra the priest and scribe, and the Levites who taught the people said to all, to all the people, This day is holy to the Lord your God. Do not mourn nor weep. For all the people wept when they heard the words of the law. Then he said to them, Go your way, eat the fat, drink the sweet, and send portions to those whom nothing is prepared, for this day is holy to our Lord. Do not sorrow, for the joy of the Lord is your strength. So the Levites quieted the people, saying, Be still, for the day is holy. Do not be grieved. Lord Jesus, we thank you for this wonderful day, time. We pray for those who are joining us online that they would also feel like they're part of the church service. We pray for those who can't join us. We pray that they would be able to join us next week. We pray that we would learn something this week, and we pray that the Bible quiz would go well. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. And we all stand to our feet and sing, The joy of the Lord is my strength. The just came as a blessing to me at the beginning of this uh, week. So there's a short chorus we're going to learn. Forgive me, we're going to sing it five times. <laughs> but it will not take more than a minute to sing it five times because it's a very short chorus. It's a beautiful song by a group called Run Collectives. It's called The Joy of the Lord is My Strength. And uh, one thing that I really blessed of the song, it says, in darkness I'll dance and in shadows I'll sing. I know it is true. and. Uh, we know that it is possible. We listened to Mary and the last week and being blessing. Thank you for sharing. Uh, we can sing and the joy of the Lord will be my strength. So let's try it out. It's a very simple uh, tune. You could uh, join along. Just we'll sing it three times and then we'll. The joy of the Lord is my strength. You need a clap. The joy of the Lord is my strength. In the darkness of Shadows are seen. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. In darkness I dance. In shadows I sing. The joy of the Lord is my strength. Last time. The joy.
Mark 5 verse 36 says, But Jesus overheard the report and said to the synagogue leader, Don't be afraid, just keep trusting. Even as we sing this next song, help, let us remember to not be afraid but to keep trusting our Lord. to do a small action if you are okay with it. Uh, you know, it is very difficult for us to trust sometimes and especially when we read in Mark 5, the daughter is going to die and, and they say daughter is dead but yet Jesus says trust and uh, trust has much to do with our heart, alright? So you can just, I know most of us know the song by heart, if you could just put your hands upon your heart, uh, physically speaking or spiritually speaking and make this a prayer to sing it to yourself and hear yourself sing and i think one part of worship is not only we sing for others to hear but for us to hear because bible says faith comes by faith comes by and hearing the word of god amen so just sing it to the lord and put our faith back in him i just keep trusting my Now we 
seventh angel sounded his trumpet and there were a loud voice in heaven which said the kingdom of the world has come the kingdom of our lord and of his messiah he and he will reign forever and ever and the 24 elders who were seated on their thrones before god fell on their faces and worshiped god saying we give thanks to you lord almighty the one who is who was and who is to come because you have taken your great power and you have begun to reign.
great I am, the one who is exalted in the midst of everything. Exalted, O God, above the heavens, let your glory be over all the earth. I have to mention this bit. Uh, interestingly, I came across this song not once or twice, but more than four or five times. and. Uh, it started off with Auntie singing it as a part of her testimony last Sunday and uh, sang it for another Tuesday fellowship. And there was a dear friend of ours who led in the department with this song. And uh, there was so much thanksgiving and in my heart that uh, as we sing along, we will sing it in a couple of languages. I would really encourage you at the time of open worship I know we come from many nations and tribes and tongues. I just want to encourage, if any of you are led to just say a word of thanksgiving during the time of worship, please do it. Do it in your own tongue, do it in your own mother language. Just let's worship the Lord and find a reason to be thankful. All right? Uh, so let's sing this song. Thank you. 
God for all that you have done. Kindly be seated. Feel free to stand up where you are and just praise the Lord. Thank Him with your hearts. I know when we speak in another language, many may not understand, but the Lord will do. Just be liberated to the fact that we worship the Lord alone. can we thank you, Lord, because you are such a good God. You always seek us. You always find us. We can never escape from you because you are our God and the devil can never snatch us away. Yes, Lord, with everything within me, I thank you, Lord, because you have always found me and you will always catch me. Lord, with all that I am, every breath, every cell. I just want to worship you, Lord, for your goodness. In Jesus' name, Amen. I just want to thank you and praise you because you are my Father, Lord. I have nothing else to say, but I just want to thank you because you are my Father. Amen. Lord, as we are gathered here to celebrate your love and your faithfulness, Lord, as your children, we are rejoicing in you, Lord. Thank you for your Holy Spirit, powerfully, very powerfully ministering to us, each one of us. Fill us, fill us up with your Holy Spirit, Lord. Let us rejoice more and more, because this is the greatest reward we get as your children in this world. Let us worship you in, in spirit and truth, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for gathering us together. Thank you for this place. In Jesus' name, we pray. Let this mind be in you, which was also in Jesus Christ, who being in the form of God did not consider it robbery to be equal with God, but made himself of no reputation, taking the form of a born servant, and coming in the likeness of men, and being found in appearance of a man, he humbled himself to the point of death, even the death of the cross. Therefore. God also has highly exalted him and given him the name which is above every name. And you be seated as we sing this song. Uh, continue uh, us to worship, sing along. Just thank one of the greatest things that we can thank God that he sent his son Jesus to die for us and his son was willing to die for us and his spirit is willing to live in us the sinful that we are, the failures that we go through, yet we can build an altar of praise in the hearts that He has given us. You came down from heaven strong, your love you found was not your home.
Lord for us Lord and Lord giving us the hope of eternal life Lord and salvation Lord we really want to praise your name Lord for showing us this great love Lord truly Lord you're an awesome God Lord thank you Jesus 